that's you responding. The baby, little sound, full. Whoa. See that? Almost maudlin. Very sentimental. Decrescendo, very soft. This is where the theme really takes off. Very lyrical, very, very lyrical. Organ, which evokes sanctity. Resolve to be. So you get the wow. idea. Yeah, I don't, I don't have any problem. Very lyrical, very, very lyrical. All built on that three note thing. I'm going to take you out though because you've got the solo in the next right. movement. You need to disappear for a little bit. Yeah, the fourth and the fifth. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah. And it's like way up here in the stratosphere. I think it's like up on an A maybe. Yeah, it's a high A. High A, yeah. 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 Not too bad. Not too bad. See that? Goosebumps. See that? <laughs> it's in a it's suddenly in a new key. It's just a static modulation, but it, it but it's, works. But it's wor it's the same motif. Same motif. motif. Yeah. It does develop into? It goes from what sounds meaningless or unformed, mm -hmm. incohate, to something that is. Way that, that there's like it, it now it's starting to look more consonant now it's starting to and now you're like talking about a little baby that's like kicking this develops but it, it it's backwards it it starts completely almost like it, it, it inverts the relationship the typical relationship between conventional harmony and expanded harmony or array tonality, it inverts the relationship, but I think it actually puts them in the proper perspective. I think when they when they hear the glockenspiel and it That's has just... that music box sound, it's going to be unmistakable. It's going to be like, and it's totally diatonic, completely diatonic. Yes. I mean, and, and we've had the Stravinsky and, and, and chromatic harmony, and then and, and we get to this. I don't, I've never heard that before.